I was asking you to do that then. I need my red onions. Did I bring already red onions here? No, I already have red onions. No, you said you wanted to change that before, right? Now what? Pantry?
so one large size red onions. I like to use red onions in pickling. We are going to pickle a cabbage. So we have our jar. Let's smoke the cabbage. We thinly slice and then soak it with vinegar, water and vinegar. Oh, my malaki pa. I'm gonna rinse it a little bit. of cabbage thinly slice soak in vinegar and water to kill all the unseen bacteria garlic you can put as much as you want so i'm gonna like two four five six thinly slice a six cloves of garlic Chop it. So the flavor of the garlic. If you want more, you can put more. All right. So. You can also mix with carrots if you want. press it in you'll know later why if you want it spicy you can put um, spicy pepper okay 
gonna mix I'm gonna put some okay so I wanna want to put one more bell pepper see how it looks now if you want to put like carrots to make it orange uh, I mean all orange uh, color in it you can you can use either green bell pepper yellow bell pepper orange bell pepper any bell pepper you want to use so just also thinly slice your bell pepper you can use any pepper you even you can even put um uh habanero pepper all right but then i'm, I'm using this i can't eat too much uh, spicy okay so then after you put the cabbage sliced cabbage tomato i mean bell pepper onions and garlic then this is the our mixture that we're going to use i boiled a liter of water a liter of water one cup of vinegar and one cup of brown sugar and i put also two tablespoons of salt and one tablespoon of black pepper i will put under the description my ingredients so you're gonna boil it and then after it's boiled you make it here here and then cool it down so you don't need to put a boiling uh, mixture in there so this is our and this will go into preserve the cabbage this is our pickling solution okay this is the the one we use to pickle the cabbage and the rest of the vegetables if you want it more sour you can add it depends on what kind of vinegar you're using i'm using the heinz vinegar uh i'm using the heinz vinegar so one liter of water plus one cup of heinz vinegar plus one cup of brown sugar you can also use white sugar so that it will not be dark like this so you can also use white sugar and any kind of vinegar so adjust the vinegar according to your taste but remember your sh vinegar and your salt is the one that will preserve the cabbage and it's the pickling you know that's the one that pickles the cabbage okay and the vegetable so this is already like cool enough for me you can cool it like very very cold it's so it, it's better actually But I will not put it too hot or boiling hot because then it will cook the vegetable and you don't want to cook the vegetable. You just want to pickle it. And then a pickled, a pickled cabbage, you can use, I mean, you can eat it anytime you want. You can partner it with fried fish or any fried meat. You can use it as an appetizer and as a salad. It's a vegetable salad. Okay, so then, the word, so I'm just gonna have to pour it. So, so I think I need more. So uh, I was only trying to do one, but then, so I needed to, boil more pickling solution so i'm gonna show you how it is done okay and then we have the water here put salt according to your taste but 
you have to put a little bit more to preserve the vegetable black pepper and then put it on your stove go With that amount of water, you can use like one cup of brown sugar. I don't have any more brown sugar. I have to go downstairs. Okay. And then make sure that it's dissolved. Like I said, <coughs> mm, it's very strong. Like I said, you can use white sugar so that it, the, your pickle, cabbage pickle will not the will not turn brown I don't put a lot of vinegar this time because the Heinz vinegar is very very sour okay so you have your water your vinegar your sugar your black pepper and your salt this is our pickling solution mm, I need more salt see you can you can like adjust to your taste this is boiled right when this is boiled you cool it down and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna put it on your um, sliced vegetables chopped vegetables okay so you can put it in the fridge when it's cool you can leave i will i always leave it uh on top of my table and uh, that's it there you go this is one way of uh, making use of the cabbage especially when it's seasoned and it's very very cheap okay bye so if you have any requests please comment below as you see i'm just gonna add it there the the pickling solution i'm making and that's it it's done you can eat it in a couple of days bye bye